guys, it's been now in the last, uh, welcome back to versus, I always just jump into the last part because I understand people would know what video we're watching. Uh, anyway, we're playing Mario Galaxy in the versus, we're up to part 5, which is pretty cool. It has been a while since I've recorded the last one. I usually record these, um, like the Friday before they come out, but last time they can't, they didn't do one. Uh, well, they skipped a week, so, like, I, I had this, I had last part sitting on my computer for a long time until, and by a long time I mean a week, until, um, the, uh, there, a week until, um, the part came up, so, yeah, so it's been, a uh, two weeks since I last recorded, so, yeah, I just realized I had star bits in the eyes of the tree. So anyway, I have had a really bad run. I have wanted to start this about 20 minutes ago. Start this recording 20 minutes ago. But I'm just having so much trouble getting my, uh, getting this laptop working. I usually use this laptop just to store the videos on. But I've kind of come to the conclusion that um, I've got a headset and I'm not using it at all for my Let's Plays right now. And I'm like, why aren't I using it? Um, Oh my gosh, the laptop finally worked. Uh, five minutes ago, I clicked end process on one of the pointless processes. It's starting up. It hasn't launched anything besides just the startup process. Oh, wait. Hold on. Um, it? Race? Okay. This is like Mario Kart. It's just after it. Maybe it's after Pyro. Um, anyway, here's a Pulsar thingy. But anyway, this laptop is so slow. It is not a Mac, unfortunately, but it is five years old and it runs on Vista and I'm attempting to use it as a... Oh, crap. I messed it up so bad. This race is pretty tough. I'll say that. Well, I kind of got the hang of it. There's this stage where you'll be picking up the most speed and that's the stage you want to be in. You want to pick up the most speed all the time. That also gets you somewhere. Gets you past that bit. But it's kind of tricky if you don't have your reflexes, because then you gotta pick it up, you know? There I go! The desktop... The desktop icon's just flash, which means it's loading that. Oh, one minute, 26. But yeah, I... This is just slow. Uh, I mean, I would understand... It's not even got that much. It's... It's... A lot of the bad stuff is Apple stuff, because my sister... No, my mum uses it. It's my mum's laptop. I don't have my own laptop, unfortunately. And you may be wondering, why don't you use your desktop? Well, then I've got to carry the, um... I've got to carry the, uh, the Wii and the TV over, because, you know, the capture card, uh, there's a delay when it comes on to the thingy, which is okay for recording, because I can just alter that in editing, but if I'm going to have to watch it, uh, this was partially evident in my, um, Toy Story 3, when I tried playing, uh, those mini games with the pointer, because I didn't have a TV back then, but my computer had slots for it. So it was generally well. Oh, this is one of the most hated stars of all. Um, but yeah, it had uh, slots on it, so I could put it in. But um, uh, the delay, it was about like a quarter of a second. But it was enough to peeve me off. It only really was annoying in the games such as the, uh, the mini games in the Butterfly Room. You know, those games. Oh yeah, I'm rebellious. I'm also really stupid. Oh gosh. I'm a chomp, I'm a rolling. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Gotta keep it. Where the heck am I going? Okay, so anyway, this is one of the most hated stars just because, one, it's a lengthy one. And two, it introduces you to a new mechanic. It's called Bomboos. They explode and they're tons of fun. What you do is you spin and you grab them by the tongue and you need to blow up that Bowser statue and I'm just not very good at it. There you go. Whoop. There's a... You can probably get some starbits from that. This... 
this star does have some, have some cool thingies in it. So anyway, if you're wondering why am I using a laptop, I'm just trying to use a... Oh, crap. I'm just using a camera. Why do I need a laptop? Well, yeah, I, I as I said, I have a headset that I've never been using. Um, I've only used it for uh, Sonic Adventure DX and... Um, and a uh, Pokemon Training Card game. There's some Star Bits. Goodbye, Star Bits. Um, yeah, and I was like, well, I'm not using. I, I didn't use it when I was recording uh, Sonic the Secret Rings, which is already finished recording. Ah, oh, Star Chips, yeah. Jeez. Considering, considering you feel like you, use, you collect Star Chips a lot, we haven't really collected too many stuff. Oh, crap. Well, thankfully, it's... There you go, that worked. <laughs> but, um... Yeah, just drag it in there. There you go. Oh, back I go. There you go. Bump. 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 Holy crap, you suck. Are you kidding? It dragged me across there! Jerk face! Holy crap, this is a- oh, This is exactly what happened last time! I was so close to a launch star. Th this happened last time. I was so close to a launch star, and then I just get killed because I'm retyping. Um, I don't care about you. you some... They don't slam in the walls, by the way, the uh, bombers. They slam the objects. All the time. I'm gonna go for that one. Ah, oh, crap you. I'm just hitting myself. Oh, gosh. So, you know, when is that roll because of Tycoon coming out? I got. Oh, crap. Evie said it was gonna come out on, um,. 22nd of May. Oh gosh. Thank goodness he caught me there. Oh my gosh, I'm 22 minutes in. Jeez. Ghostly Galaxy is one of the ones I don't like. Where the heck am I going? I'm going for the star there. Why not? It's a, it is a star. <laughs> so anyway, this is why it's one of the most hated galaxies. Not because of that. Not because of that, but because there's a Luminary, so you can tell there's a shop. There's, I mean, of course there's a shop! There's a boss! But this is the most hated boss. And everybody loves to see his return in, um, Galaxy 2 in one of the later stages. So anyway, you know he's throwing rocks. The black ones will drop bombos. The yellow ones will drop, uh, coins. So, you gotta note that. Now always remember that. Oh crap. Also, you want to stay away from those when you're dealing with bombers, because those things get annoying. You can spin them away, that's that's fine. But you gotta make sure you don't um you don't slam the bombers in them, because otherwise you'll lose your bomber. Anyway, he takes a few hits. And then he becomes Mr. Something something. Uh you gotta grab your bombu and you gotta slam it into him. So anyway, yeah. I don't see why it was that bad. No, of course he has a second form. The second form plays exactly the same, except he has hands. The hands will block two shots each. Now, it's possible to hit him without having to hit the hands, and it's more recommended that you hit him instead of hitting the hands. But, um, he'll also drop a couple of bombers. Oh, crap. He'll drop, like, two bombers. Oh, crap. Uh, so, yeah... Are you kidding me? That hit me? Serious? Oh, snap. So anyway, you may be wondering, well, he's just got hands. I'll just take a few more hits. No, because he regenerates his hands. Now, it's okay once you've destroyed one of his hands. It's also recommended you space those guys out so that you hit him twice rather than hitting him in his invincibility. 
Jeez, he is one of the most annoying bosses. He is the most annoying boss in this game. Bowser is nowhere near as hard as this. There you go, I hit him. Oh. Nope, oh, I'm in existence. There you go. You know what? He's not too tough. But I got hit twice in that match. You're gonna, you're gonna really rage when I tell you there's a daredevil that requires you to beat this guy in one life. That is one of the most annoying stars in the game. That's like up there with freeze flame purple coins. Freeze flame purple coins, there is no risk though. That's the thing. You'll get annoyed with time because you'll be like, where the heck is that last purple coin? But this, this is, this is like, you need to pretty much nail everything because everything is against you. Not only is he throwing rocks, you also need to watch out for the bombos, which you're supposed to be using, and you gotta watch out for his punches. There's a lot of things to watch out for. Um, <sighs> he is an annoying boss. Um, that pretty much leaves us to... Speaking of boss, we gotta fight Bowser. Or Bowser Jr. Um, you don't fight Bowser Jr., you fight um, Bowser Jr.'s item. items? Bosses. Random bosses. So anyway, yeah, I'm trying to get... Uh, Oh, by the way, with the laptop, and then I'm also going to get my headset, and then I'm also going to have the, uh, the capture card. My capture card isn't, uh, the, again, the laptop is crappy enough not even to be able to record in 480p without freaking out. It doesn't record in any P without freaking out. Uh, it was okay with recording audio in my new LP that I'm not going to be announcing, although LMG Gaming knows. Um, he also doesn't want me to play it, because he, he doesn't want to subject it, me to such horror. You guys will... Guess what I'm playing. Um, just name it the flagpole, but. Oh, crap you. Stop, stop grabbing onto that freaking thing. Uh, so, anyway, yeah, it's, this stage isn't actually very annoying. In fact, it kind of passes by. There's not really that much to annoy with. It's, it's a very fun stage. There's a lot of stuff. There you go. You're a bit more pro if you can hit the uh, flagpoles, but it's recommended you aim at the top so you can use. So if you're a little bit off, because you've got to be really precise, you want to hit the flagpoles. I like doing this. Whoa. Also, don't really spin jump. Crap! That was close. That was close. That was like closer than. chicken. You know how much I like chicken. Oh, but look, a boss. See, that's how quick this stage is. I did that in like a minute and a half or something. You just don't give up. You want this grand side, you're going to have to take it. Oh, I guess we do fight him. Alright. What do you do? You throw shell. Throw, grab shell, throw it. I really don't see that much challenge in this. I, I can see the, the dangers. Oh, crap. That, that is a really attack. This calls for second phase. Oh, I'm gonna kill that magic creeper. Oh crap! Oh, I didn't get the coin because. Oh, that worked. Oh. For a second I was going, oh gosh, I probably need a coin, but... Yeah, he wasn't that tough. In fact, yeah, he's not really one of the even big bosses. You'd expect a big boss like Megalek to come out. But no, it's just kind of him, man. That's... Yeah, I know. So we got Grand Star. I'm very happy about that. I wish we had more stars, though. I'd really like to get, like, eight stars this part, because... We're, like, halfway in, and we've only got three. Granted, they are some of the more annoying stars. Like, I... I, I do agree, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, where is the board? Where is the board that tells you where the stars are? So anyway, yeah, we've got four grand stars, which is very good. Um, and we've unlocked the next dome, which is the bedroom. So 38 stars, that's good. No galaxy. Oh, okay, all of them. Holy crap! There's a comment in there. I was gonna. I was gonna. Um, the engine. Yeah. We'll fly like a starship, and you'll be able to fly. So 
I'll save. Um, that comet was white. I'm gonna say that was the Daredevil. Or was the Daredevil red? What was the other gas? I can't remember. That was two weeks ago. Um. Oh, of course. Uh, beach ball. No, we already did beach ball. Holy! Cr you know what? I'm gonna knock that off. I'm gonna knock that um that uh, comet off. I don't care if I've got enough starbits to feed the Hungry Luma, I want to go knock off that comet. I know exactly, exactly what I'm, what I'm in for. But it is one of the hardest, if not the hardest, star in the game. Some people say the Green Star Comets, the, well, the Green Star Galaxies. This is the hardest star in my opinion. I think I had the most annoyance in this star. And if I lose all my lives, jeez. So my, my life, my death counter would be a bit off. And of course, no Luma Shop, because you got, you got one hit. One hit! And I got hit twice. And he doesn't throw coins. None of these guys throw... No Dev Devil has coins. Oh, gosh. Okay, so I guess the first thing I'll recommend is just run around, because the Boo Bombs give you enough time. Why is he throwing two? Oh, okay. Oh, you, you gotta throw boo bombs. I'm not quite sure their official their official name, but I like calling them boo bombs. It would probably be similar. Give me your boo. There you go. You know what? If it was that, it would be quite easy, but just because he's got the second phase, that means there's a lot to hit. You know, I'm actually quite happy I got up to this bit that I hit. I mean, I know it's the easier half, but... Move your fist. Oh, crap. I like that effect he's got there, where this, where the, it's like a, it's like a background on his hands. Oh, also those spikes hurt you when they're coming up, but he does knock the spikes. Oh, come on! He, yeah, this is what he does. He does his other attacks. His other hand will come up before I get the chance to attack him again. That's how it works. There you go. So that's one hit. Jeez. I'm okay that I haven't gotten hit yet. I'd rather not be getting hit. Oh gosh. Speaking of which, I, I, I want to thank um, LMG Gaming for uh, giving me Picross 3D when he went over to America. I, I really appreciate it. I love the game. Even if it's not the best LP. Move your fist! Apparently his fist is invulnerable for a second there, so we'll just kind of pass this through him. Okay. I'm actually quite surprised this is going quite well. Oh! Oh! I am never going to say that ever again. That was the thing, I was two hits away as well. Oh my gosh, he doesn't get any harder the more hits. Oh, that's good you went up with a black rock. Well, I like the drum track underneath. See, that's how quick it is! Without his hands! With his hands, he'll have the urge to punch you and slam his fists down. So, you know, it takes so much longer just because he won't give you more opportunities. If a boss truly was adaptive, he would stop showing his weak point. I remember one boss in this game. I can't remember what game it was. I think it was actually one of the Batman games. Um, where he just constantly... Yeah, it was uh, Arkham City when you fight... Um, uh, 
Victor Freeze. And uh, he just constantly changes his... Uh, whenever you hit him with something, he'll do something which will prevent you from doing that again. This is a very good game, Arkham City. Oh, oh wow! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That is the luckiest! That is the luckiest go at this. I have... That has probably been filmed. It's filming, yeah. I don't care if it's four stars. He's a, this is the most... This is one of the most annoying stars. And I'm, I'm glad I did it in one life. As much as I spent so much on that first life. I commend myself. Clap to the monitor if you feel like it. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, what was I talking about? Crap, I forgot what I was talking about. So yeah, I play Picross 3D. Um, it's the it's a US version, by the way. It's not a European version, so some things. Uh, why am I going back in here? I don't need. Ooh, don't really stop it. I don't need to go back in here. I need to go back outside and feed the hungry Luma because then I'll be clear with this dome. So 600 star bits, uh, I think the next one's 800. So that, so that'll be one of the more annoying factors, you know, just because I'll need so many more star bits. Especially near the end of the game. Thankfully these, uh, these, uh, galaxies don't have comets, so, so... You may possibly just beat the game and then, uh, tackle on some of the other comets and stuff, picking up star bits as you go. Um, because, uh... Yeah, I mean, you'll need like 2,000 in order to feed the last Hungry Luma. So anyway, this is a funky galaxy. It's like one planet. How is it a galaxy? Because well, it's got a star, of course. I'm also taking my time flying across the entire thing. It's got some nice music. So anyway, what you gotta do is you gotta kill the eel. I don't think I need their explanation. Oh. Kill the, kill the eels, I think. I think you gotta kill uh, the eels. Uh, I got you in my sights. You swerved. Thankfully, some Mario Kart logic. Are you kidding me? Why am I having so many, so many trouble? Die, you. So yeah, there's no blue shells, but your red shells will come in, so use red shells if you can if you're around some. Where the heck is the other is the other green shell? There's a red shell. Might be there. Ah, camera. There you go. Woo! Stop it. Ah, green shell. Oh, what? what the heck is that noise? Am I supposed to like leave a phone in there or something? <laughs> I swear I am not getting as many stars as I intended. I'll probably get seven. There you go. And that's it. You just gotta kill the three eels. There's a later galaxy that's similar to this. In fact, I think you gotta play this one in order to get that in the shell, because I have no idea where the star is, it's over here. <laughs> do, do. But yeah, there's a lighter galaxy that's similar to this, except there's an actual boss there instead of just three. This is a really pointless galaxy, may I just say? I understand if you're trying to show off your circular swimming thing, but uh, I don't know, I'd probably think it would work better on a larger scale, maybe five eels. I know three is the magic number in Nintendo Land. Um, but anyway, we're gonna head off to the bedroom, I guess, because in the bedroom. I know we've got six minutes. I'm hoping we can knock off two stars, but that's gonna be a bit of a stress. I gotta do the comments in uh, the first um, galaxies in the first time. There's an enemy base. <laughs> That's the thing, you need 60 stars in order to beat the game, and this one's... This is... This has arguably the best music, but I prefer Boy Bass. Boy Bass is my favorite galaxy, but this has the second best music. I think it's just because it's orchestrated. People love orchestrated. Um, 
but yeah, you need 60 stars to beat the game, and, uh, you know, considering you only really, you only need to beat the boss galaxies in order to actually progress, uh, there's, you know, a star limit for those. Now, I could go around trying to get those star bits. I'll get this one, because I feel like it. So this is what you do. You spin these, and then you grab on. hit that in order to get yeah I believe you need to get all the oh crap what the crap just happened I seem to be dying just before checkpoints there's no marked checkpoints in this game uh, they're usually just after- I, mean, I like that big question mark too. Um, there's usually, uh, you know, there's checkpoints after, like, every set of planets. Like, every- AGAIN! WHAT THE CRAP! WHAT THE CRAP! WHAT?! THAT'S TWICE! WHAT?! OH MY GOSH! This is not helping. At all. I'm gonna lose my voice tomorrow. Seriously. I'm gonna get a lot of star bits in the process, but I don't care about star bits. Oh, do I? No, I don't. I'd prefer to get seven stars than a lot more star bits. Especially since I was doing a lot more in the past, like, eight videos, or three. Ah, psych you. Oh yeah, there's something over the other side. Aha, Sprout. Jump! Mega Man! No, that's not how you do it, you gotta kill one of these guys, I remember. Maybe this one. Yeah, that's this one. I'm probably guessing someone can see this bracket. Anything on the other side? There you go. Woo! Ah, uh, no, I can't. Oh, goodness, I'm gonna kill you. That guy's a big guy. Yeah, I'm still doing this after um, not watching the videos because I I'm trying to keep their progress a secret. Six stars, it's not good in keeping a good head. I wanna, I wanna finish like a couple parts of, uh, last night. So you gotta catch this guy, which is pretty annoying. Oh crap! Try jumping there. Oh, uh, what? I am not having a good time with this. I bet you someone's probably done this like super duper super quick. It'd be easier as Luigi. Oh my gosh, Mario, you fat. You are so fat, Mario. Remember this? Oh, thank goodness. You know what really sucks? I'm not gonna be able to get another star. Crap. Oh my gosh. Cause pot's almost ended. Oh gosh. Oh. I'm a little bit unhappy about my progress in this episode. I don't exactly know where they went. I think they were just deaths. I could have totally gone another three minutes on this part if I didn't die three times. Um, four times, yeah. Crap! I'm gonna go outside and feed the Hungry Luma. That's about it. Because the buzz is gonna go off. Wait a second now. Where's the Hungry Luma? Hungry Luma's up here. No, you're a red Luma. Where is the Hungry Luma? Huh. 
There it goes. Whoa, draw doesn't. I, I see so much draw distance in today's video games. Seriously. I was, like... Draw distance and Poppin. What is with Poppin? Okay? May I just say this? Poppin is, um... By the way, Poppin... Yeah, for those who don't know, Poppin is, uh, when textures don't fully load when you look at them, so you see the textures update with their higher resolution ones. Um, I'm okay with that. But it's really stupid, especially in games like uh, Rage and a lot of Unreal Engine games, um, where you just see the textures just don't load straight away. And I don't know, it's especially bad in Rage, because um, I just look and turn around and I see the textures not loaded. I understand that memory is, is a precious tool you don't want to use too much, but why are the textures on when I look away from something. Why do they unload? Seriously. Just keep like the area's textures around me. Metro Prime did a genius drop job of this. It just let, waited at the doorways, but at least you didn't see Poppin all the time. Anyway, I'm rambling. See you kids next year. Crap, six stars. Jeez. I feel ashamed. And I'll call that a day.